Hello everyone, this is Priya Dashini, Assistant Professor, Department of BBA, KSR College of Arts and Science for Women. Today I am going to talk about custom duty. Custom duty means goods are imported or exported from India through sea, air or land. Goods may even come through within postal services, baggage, when the passenger travel in and out of the country. Objectives of Custom Act and Custom Duties To restrict the import for conserving foreign exchange To protect the import and exports of goods For achieving the policy objectives of government To regulate the export To coordinate legal provisions with other laws dealing with the foreign exchange such as foreign trade, foreign trade act and foreign exchange regulations act. The next one is to safeguard the domestic trade, to protect the revenue of resource, to protect the industries in India from unfair competitions, to prevent the smuggling of goods and activities related to the same to prevent the dumping of goods. These are the objectives of Custom Act and Custom Duty. Next one is the importance of Custom Duty. First one is the receiving the revenue, protect the domestic industry, reducing the defect in the balance of trade under the balance of payment, controlling the smuggling, reducing the export, saving foreign exchange. These are the importance of custom duties. Next one is a types of custom duties. The first one is a basic custom duties. A basic custom duty is applicable on imported item that falls under the section at 1962. Next one is a additional custom duty. Countervailing duty. It is called as a CVD. This is levied on import items under the section 5 of the Custom Tariff Act 1975. It is equal to central excess duty that is levied on similar goods producers within India. This duty is calculated on the aggregated value of goods including BDC and landing charges. Next one is a productive duty. Productive duty may be imposed to shield the domestic industry against import at a rate recommended by the tariff commissioner. Next one is a educational chess. This duty is levied at 2% and Higher education chess at another 1% of aggregated to custom duties. Next one is anti-dumping duty. Anti-dumping duty may be imposed if the goods is being imported at the below fair market price and is limited to the difference between export and normal price. Next one is safeguard duty. Safeguard duty is levied if the government feels that a sudden increasing in export can potentially damage the domestic industry. This is the types of custom duty. Thank you.